Okay, so now that we've seen how we can go and gather all of our foliage paths into a single work item or a partition bucket, right? We want to actually write this stuff out to a CSV. And the reason why we're going to write this out to a CSV, as you'll see later on in this section, is we want to then get all those paths from a single source, so the one CSV file. And we want to write all those paths to the different points so we can instantiate those prefabs onto the points that are being scattered onto our terrain, okay? So let's take a look at how we actually write to CSV. All right, I want to kind of take this in you know small steps here. Okay, so let's jump back into Houdini and get going. Okay, so what we want to do is we want to take all this data that we have here. So I just double clicked on our partition work item. So we want to take all this data here and we want to write it into a CSV file so we can read it back into our HDA that's going to be responsible for scattering our foliage. Okay, and you notice that at the end of each of these particular file paths, there's this file tag. All right, so it's indicating that it's a type of file. And that's going to work really well for us because what we can do is we can uh, drop down a CSV output node. All right, you can see there's quite a few CSV nodes here. All right. Uh, but we're, what we're interested in is this CSV output. So I'm going to wire this in after the wait for all node and set the output flag on the CSV output node here. And what we're going to do is we're going to set up a few parameters up here. So I do want to write an output CSV file. Okay. And to do this, what I want to do is I want to send it into my, my Unity and uh, Houdini project. All right. And remember, because we set up our environment variables earlier in this course, all right, we set up this environment variable here. That's our working directory. We want, we want it to go into that particular project directory. So what we're going to do is we're going to say $PDG dir. All right, so now we have access to that particular Houdini project. Okay, and I'm going to say forward slash, and we're going to make a new folder called CSV, like so. And then we are going to write the foliage dot csv file okay and we want to make sure that we do indeed write a header for this okay just to make this work and then what we want to do is we want to look for everything that is of type file so we need to add a new data query here so i'm going to add a new data query and so what we're going to be looking for is a file so anything that has an attribute name or a result tag of file which is all of these paths okay is going to be written to our csv output all right so let's dirty and cook this output node here and you can see we have one CSV file so if I were to click on this to open it up in Excel there we go we actually have all of our paths to all of our foliage prefabs inside of unity pretty cool super cool all right so that was actually pretty easy um, and you can do a lot more with all this, but we're going to focus on just keeping this relatively simple because I, I want to move forward and I want to, you know, get to all the other cool bits about scattering and roads and uh, clearing out areas of your, your terrain. So um, this is going to work for us for now. Okay. So with that, what I'm going to do is close out this lecture. And in the next lecture, we're going to start working on our HDA. All right. That will actually go and scatter all of our foliage. Okay, thanks so much.